thanks for watching. Welcome back. Today we're doing a balcony makeover on my own balcony, which I'm really excited for. We spend so much time out here. The cats love sunbathing and rolling around. And I found the cutest, the cutest patio set. Just happens to be from Amazon. Super affordable, very cute, very like modern. Um, and I feel like it's very neutral, so it will match with a lot of patio or backyard uh, decor that you guys may have. So if you see anything that you like in this video, I will have everything linked down in the description. The patio set, the really nice soft rug that I picked up for my cats to lay on, something soft, but also just to add some color and some more character up here to make it a little bit more of a fun space. And there's a few other things as well. And now I already do have these Edison light bulbs that are really cool. And I will try to find those as well and I'll link those down below. But yeah, pretty easy, pretty affordable. I think everything was under 250 or 300. So yeah, I have everything linked down below. I hope you guys enjoy this and let's get to it. All right, y'all, I've been wanting to do this for a little while now because now that the weather is actually warmer, we're out here all the time. And by we, I mean me and my cats. They love it out here and I love it out here and I have almost every single meal out here and they love laying in the sun. They're always out here with me. So I just needed to make this such a more inviting, cozy, cool looking place instead of just a beach chair. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a really comfy beach chair and I like it, but it belongs at the beach and probably not on my balcony. All right, I really like this. For one, it's really soft, like carpet soft. And I love the colors, I love the pattern. It's a really nice pop of blue and it's nice for pets to lay on because it's much softer than obvious wood planks. The only thing is that it does need to fall flat in the corners and there's a little bit of like that rug smell, like new rug smell, but that should wear away in a day or two, especially being aired out here outside. table and the chairs I'm so excited to share with you guys and show you what they look like oh wait you can already see what one of the chairs looks like also this fake plant this fake palm plant is so beautiful but I'm not sure if I should put it there if I should put it here to kind of hide the um, vent here uh, I don't know let's just see what that looks like I suppose but look how cute it is I like that it has these handles on it and this is actually pretty weighty like I probably couldn't knock that over even if I wanted to it's pretty heavy all right, y'all, everything is put together and I am so happy with the way everything turned out. Look how beautiful this is. I'm so happy with it. I really wish I would have done this last summer now, but I moved in towards the end of the summer. So I didn't do anything out here, but now I'm regretting it because <laughs> look how good this looks. I feel like this turned out way better than I thought it would. And I cannot believe that all of this on this balcony was just around $250 and I love this table and chair set. I will share more details about it in just a minute. But I am so impressed with everything. The quality seems great so far. I love that palm plant. It's so beautiful. And then these are just some extra things that I added. So the wood is acacia wood, which is really strong and durable. I believe the chairs can hold up to 350 pounds and then the table can hold up to 165 pounds it has a really nice finish and i love the tone of it it's a tropical wood and it's also resistant to rain salt water and chlorine so this is great to have at your pool your backyard or even the beach because it's resistant to all of those elements 
The cushions are also nice and padded. They're about two and a half inches. And there's a zipper on the back of the bottom pad so you can remove it and wash it really easily, which I love. They're also resistant to stains, to water, to fading, and resistant to mold and mildew. Here's a better look of the zipper on the back of the cushion so you can take it off to wash it. And you tie both of the cushions to the back of the wood just like this. Now the um, the top pad here for your back. This one does not have a zipper so you cannot take it off to wash it but I feel like you, you would get more stains on the bottom pad than you would this so that makes sense to me that it doesn't have a zipper. Also this one is thinner and doesn't stay in place very well. If you sit down it kind of slides which I don't like because I want it to stay just like that. So if you have any ideas of how I could keep them from sliding, maybe like a tack or even like a nail to keep the bows in place, let me know. This rug is again so beautiful. It seems very durable and it's very, very soft and very pretty. It comes in a ton of different colors and the kitties seem to like it too. This is the four by six size that I have in the rug, but they have a, a many other different sizes. The palm plant is bendable, so you can move the palms any way that you need to. I also love that it comes with the basket and the moss already, so you don't need to buy anything additional. That's just all ready and set to go. These Edison light bulbs are so pretty and I love the vibe they create. They make the space so cozy and they're just so cool. These are from the hardware store from last summer, but I will link a very similar pair from Amazon that have like 32,000 reviews on them. They are a hit. I also have this outdoor outlet that comes with the remote with a timer. So even when I'm inside, I can turn the lights on or off and keep them on a timer which I love. <laughs> it's so nice when I'm inside. I also wanted to mention this magnetic screen door that I have because inside there's just the door. There's actually no screen door to come out here. So this is another Amazon find and you just tack it in or it also comes with Velcro strips if you don't have wood to tack it in and it stays pretty well. The magnets are pretty strong and it goes all the way from the top to the bottom. They also have different sizes, and I've been really happy with this. It keeps the bugs out, and the cats are still easily able to go through it, um, or underneath it, as they have done. But this has been a game changer, and I know a lot of people that don't have screen doors love this and rave about it, and I'm definitely one of them. I will link this down below as well if any of you guys are interested in it. But overall, I am so happy with the way this space came out and now I can sit and I can enjoy the sunset tonight. It is so beautiful. I don't know if my camera will pick it up, but it's beautiful. All right, y'all. Well, thank you for hanging out with me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs it up. Remember, everything that I showed and everything that I built is in the description. Super easy to build. You can definitely do it. It took me probably an hour to build both chairs and the table. Super easy. Instructions and all that. So I highly recommend it. I will place everything in the description below. And subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my Etsy shop, my blog, my Instagram for daily updates, my Facebook, all of that. All of my handles and descriptions are down in the description below. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you very soon in a brand new video. Bye.